Hello and welcome back to another video. In this problem, we're asked what is the minimum value of the given function? g of x is equal to x squared plus 55. So the minimum value of a quadratic like this one is the vertex. So we want to get this into vertex form. What does that look like? Well, it would be f of x is equal to a times x minus h squared plus k. And this gives you the vertex h, k. Now here, we have a little bit of a special case. So first of all, a is the coefficient of the x squared term, which in this case is just one. One times anything is just this itself, so we can ignore that. Next, what is h? Well, h we usually find from the x term, right? However, we just have an x squared term and a constant. We don't have an x term. Therefore, this whole term is just x minus 0 squared, because that'll give you x squared minus 0x plus 0. And this gives you the lack of an x term, right? Since 0x is just 0, these just cancel. That gives you not having an x term in your quadratic. Therefore, we have g of x is equal to x minus 0 squared plus k. What is k? k is 55 what's left over, plus this term right here. However, since this term right here is just zero, we don't even have to worry about it. Therefore, g of x is equal to one, that a term, times x minus zero squared plus 55. So this is the vertex form, which means that the vertex is zero, 55, right? H, k. What is the minimum value of the given function? Is it 0 or 55? Well, g is a function that takes values of x and spits out values of y, right? So at the value of x is equal to 0, the value of the function is 55. And this value of the function 55 is the minimum value. b is your final answer.